Praise ye the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise ye the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise ye the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise ye the Lord. It can be hard to find a good, clean, fun family movie. And that's why I'm so excited about this new film that's out called Family Camp. It actually stars the skit guys, and they're with me today, Tommy and Eddie. Guys, I'm excited about this movie, but... Your whole vision as the skit guys is to bring humor to the church. I've been a fan of what you guys do for a really long time. Uh, how long have you been doing the skit guys? Or was it called something before that? Well, back in the day, it was way back in the day, in the 80s, when we started doing this, um, we started in high school going to, um, you know, going around to churches in Oklahoma. And uh, we were called the ET show, but people thought we were, you know, trying to replicate aliens and eating Reese's Pieces, so we had to change it. Yeah, so, yeah. which we were. Yeah, so because <laughs> in the 90s, I think, um, basically we started doing conferences, and usually you'd have a band, mm -hmm. Crowder or Tomlin, right, and uh, Mercy Me, and then a speaker, and then they'd always, then, you know, they'd be sitting around going, we need some skit guys. And so we decided to call ourselves skit guys. Yeah. You just come to mind. That's that's an incredibly long time to do this. And I love that you're bringing humor to the church. You're bringing the art of like skits done well. Thank it's actually you. hard to do this art well. Mm -hmm. And so tell me why you think it's important to bring theater to the church and to make people laugh. Oh, I, I, I think it because if you look at the history of the church, that's what happened, right? I mean, Jesus told parables. He told stories. The natural progression of that is you tell the story so that the truth can enter, you know? And we, we choose humor because we believe that humor breaks down walls for the truth to enter. You know, if you can get them to laugh, you can get them to listen. And then you have to have something good to say. And the word of God is the best thing to say. Yeah, that's so good. This movie is a whole new platform for you guys. So Family Camp, I mean, I'm so excited about this film because it brings all those things together. It brings spiritual truth. It brings humor. It's like actually really fun and entertaining. Your character alone, Eddie, is like, is it intergalactic chiropractic? Intergalactic chiropractic? <laughs> Like, who comes up with those things? Was that your idea? Were you like, I'm dying to play a weird chiropractor? <laughs> yes. Yeah, that's that was it. Yeah. He's he's uh, a cross between uh, he's the over, overly religious type person. Um, you know, the 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 family that after church, they're looking for someone to go have lunch with. And you're like, Let, let's go. Let's go left. Come on. Come on, guys. Come on, kids. Don't kids eat with them. This way. Don't. Come on, kids. We got to go. We, we got to go. be with them. <laughs> An hour at church with them is enough. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. And Tommy, you're like the normal guy, I think, that struggles. And one of the big themes, it would seem, is leadership for your family. So what 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 inspired that for you? Has that been a struggle for either of you? Or are there lessons you learned that you put into the into the character? Yeah, definitely. So like as a pastor, I don't really understand climbing the corporate ladder, but I do understand busy, you know, and I think pastors can be as guilty as anyone as being busier than God intended them to be, you know, too busy for your family, you know, and so I think the Tommy Ackerman character, I think people will connect with him from that perspective. Um, did that speak to me? Yeah. I mean, I, I, like I said, can be as guilty as anyone for being too busy. And so this week away for, for Tommy Ackerman, for the character that I play, was a week about, you know, remembering what is most important, faith and family, you know, and, and being encouraged, you know, not, not beat over the head, but just being encouraged to be there for your family and to love on them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's such an important message. I think especially right now, I think there's been so much stress on the family over the last few years. The timing of this feels right. And I think so many of us wish we could get away for a week to do something like this, but it's not always possible. So what are the takeaways you hope people will apply even if they can't go to a family camp? What I like about this movie and what we really try to do is the, the dads aren't bumbling idiots, you know, like, I mean, so many sitcoms, so many things, you know, it's like, you know, they, they made it there by accident and, <laughs> and, and, you know, the wives are going along the way going, you idiot here, let me grab this and, you know, problem solved. And the kids are always smarter than everybody. Um, you won't find that in this movie. You're going to find moms, dads, kids, they all, they all have problems, you know, 
we call them the three H's, hurts, habits, and hangups. Everybody has a hurt. Everybody has a, therefore they have a hangup, a character defect, which leads to a lot of us have, has bad habits. We do things that we don't want to do. Um, so you're going to see in this movie, these, they, these things play out with each character and they got to, they got to unravel it. Families can be messy, but God makes us masterpieces. Mm. So you watch these people kind of just chisel away some of the things. God allows them to chisel away some of the things in their life to become who they need to be. So um, I I love the fact that when we hear interviews for this movie of people going, what'd you think of the movie? What'd you think of the movie? Uh, depending on their demographic, there's people that come away with different things. And I love that. I love that. So you probably are hoping people do see themselves in one of these characters or in the family and go, yeah, nobody's perfect. Like, yeah. <laughs> even yeah. though they know Jesus, love Jesus, they are a mess, which yes. we all relate to. Yeah, 100%. Um, can you guys tell me what was the most fun thing to film? Because there's so many fun scenes. Sometimes I'm like, I would love to get in like a blow up bouncy ball and play mm -hmm. soccer, but it's probably actually really hot and not fun when you have to do it for hours. So tell me what was actually the most fun thing to film. Bubble ball was fun, but you're exactly right. There's a lot of pictures of us in between takes, you know, with people with fans just blowing on us, you know, because it's just so <laughs> hot. Um, there is a scene. Oh, gosh, there's so many fun scenes. There's a there's a scene where uh, Eddie and I are uh, wrestling each other like in, in the water, like we're trying to cross a river and it turns into a fight and we're trying to drown each, each other. And uh, that just was an improv like. The director just basically said, go for it, guys. And so it was just us having a lot of fun. Yeah. yeah. Were you guys like, we finally get to let out our friendship aggression? Yeah. Right. Right. I've been yes. wanting to hit him for weeks. Let's yes. go. It was therapy. <laughs> it was a therapy yeah. river. Yeah. Yeah, that's wild. And I there's this scene, Eddie, where you are, um, you're trying to get honey and like the bees. Get that thing away from me! My skin is on fire! I need to know if any of the bees were real and how you did that. Because I would be terrified to film around bees. They no, that was all. I guess what movie would you magic, guess? movie magic, CGI, whatever they call it. You know, <laughs> but you can't. It's so we crazy. Think, like you can't. Yeah, tell. we think we Eddie's so brave. He's like, there wasn't a bee there. Yeah, not it was one. not uh, not one. Uh, 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 uh. That is crazy. I would literally never know. Mm -mm. Um, well, I guess he's not as brave as we thought. That's right. That's <laughs> yeah. right. Yeah, one of my when you watch it, um, I'll just we'll just say bee sting. And listen to the flapjack, um, oh, the flapjack stuff. That was all. So funny. That was all improv. That was all I live, and that was a lot of fun too. So yeah. I love that you guys can bring that to a set because that is that's your life. You and you guys are so used to playing off of each other. Mm -hmm. um, I'm curious for you guys. Did you go to family camp growing up? Why is this a good setting? You think for this kind of movie? The genius behind this movie was by the writer director Brian Cates. He's the guy who came up with the whole idea of family camp. And when he shared it with us, we were like, oh, stars, like this is what families need right now. And and you know, yeah, this is what I, I love about God's plan is that this whole plan came out three years, two years before the pandemic. Mm -hmm. Now wow. that we're on the other side of it, like our families need this even more. It, you know, God yeah. knew what was coming down the pipe. And so like, I feel like he gave us something that would really bless families and encourage families. I think that's exactly what we need right now. And there's there's humor in it. So it's not like you're just sitting down to be like, let's get a gold nugget. You're going to have a ball watching yeah. this bad boy. In the vein of church camp, I want to play a quick game with you guys before we close. Yeah. Um, because one of the most iconic things about camp, I'm sure even family camp are the songs. You sing all these songs together. So I'm going to sing you a couple of lyrics of a church camp song and see if you guys can finish it. Okay. Sound good? Ooh, okay. 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 Here we go. We're going to okay. test if you really know about family camps. Okay. okay. Hallelujah. 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 Praise ye the Lord. Okay. You're already Hallelujah. doing Hallelujah. Okay. Praise ye the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise ye the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise ye the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise ye the Lord. Okay. You're so holy. I think you're going to have no problem with this. All right. Here's the next one. I'm coming back to the heart of worship. Because it's all about you. It's all, all about, about you, Jesus. Oh, that's a super that spiritual one. one. When we were like, song. we're not going to sing with anything but a guitar because yeah. we're simplifying. Yes. Right? Yes. Oh, okay. Here's oh, a good and, one. And and we're gonna we're gonna take off our sandals. We're gonna take off our shoes. <laughs> yeah, this is holy ground. I'm sorry, you yeah. took off your shoes during that. 
Yeah, that is too people. much for me. You don't know. You don't even know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not holy enough for that. I kept mine on. All right, here we go. Father Abraham had many sons. Mm-hmm. Had many sons, had Father Abraham, yes. and I am one of them, and so are you. So let's just let's praise the Lord, right <laughs> on. <laughs> we should do that more. That's like Christian cardio. I haven't right done that in a minute. Ooh. Okay, uh, this one, I have maybe some issues with this song now as an adult. Hmm. I may never march in the infantry, ride in the cavalry, shoot, shoot the, the artillery. Ooh. I may never... Uh, I may never. I don't know. Oh, fly. Uh, but I'm in the Lord's uh, army. That's oh, it. That's yes, sir. Thing. What is it? Yes. Fly or the enemy. Fly or. I'm in the that's Lord's why, army. That's why, because that's not even a word. Or. Or. or, or I don't or. fly or the enemy. Oh, fly gosh, over. Yeah. Or. We skip letters to make it fit. Right. Okay, yeah, <laughs> okay we got one. two more. Here we go. Here I am to worship. Here I am to bow down. Here I am to say, say that you're, you're my God. You guys. We're all together lovely. All, all together to worthy. All together, together wonderful to me. I sure hope you guys got to sing in this movie because I'm enjoying it. <laughs> Nobody it's pretty good. harmonica. Yeah, play harmonica. Oh, that's right. You do. Oh, my goodness. So good. Okay, here's the last one. Okay. There's motions. You oh. came from heaven to earth to show the way from the earth to the cross. Oh, yeah. My debt to pay from the cross to the grave, from the grave to the sky. Lord, I lift your name on high. That's oh, yeah. it. Yes, you guys passed with flying colors. You Thank do know you. family camp. Um, I was worried about that one. Why didn't you do Friends or Friends Forever? Oh, my goodness. The oh, that's such forever. a good one. Yeah. You're right. Michael yeah. Dubs, he deserves to be there. Right. We can change are, it. Friends, friends or Families are Families Forever. Families friends till Friday. Yeah. That's the camp version. Friends or Friends till Friday. <laughs> yeah. If the Lord's the Lord of them. Yeah. Yeah. And then get their email address and you'll never hear from them again. That's right. <laughs> that's right. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, that's so good. Thank you for your time. Oh. Family Camp is out now. Make sure you check it out. Such a fantastic film. Thanks for what you guys do.